Hey there, I'm Luke the Cooking Camper back in Iowa working on a really fun little garden um, project. I'm going to make up a little pot, so I just wanted to show you some of the places we go, some of the plants we get, and the completed pot. So right now we are at this beautiful nursery, and I absolutely love all of these sedum, but they don't really go with the vibe that I am going for. But I mean, look at how beautiful they are. I already picked out a um, little basil plant at Tyson's. So now we're just gonna keep driving around until we find um, plants that I like. And that's very pretty. I really like these little hostas and they kind of look like cheese. I also like this little hocus pocus thing, but I don't know, the coloring is a little strange. And I really like all of these right here, but not for $18. And I like this. I need something kind of shorter that's like a brown and yellow color, but this is too green. And I really like these because you do have that darker color and then they have white blooms and they've got some with red blooms. These have been at multiple stores that we've been to. They are so beautiful. Pretty little geranium. These are pretty. Look at how huge that lily is. This one's even bigger. So we ended up with tons of plants. I've got all of these for options and this is gonna sound a little bit crazy, but this is actually for a family member who makes the best pizza in the world, you guys. So we've got a little pot and it's, this is gonna be like a loose artistic interpretation of like a pepperoni pizza. So we've got some begonias with this brown foliage is kind of the crust around the inside. And then now I'm gonna decide what of everything else will fill in the pizza. And I'll probably just show it to you guys once I'm done. I mean, planting an arrangement is pretty self-explanatory. And what I did want to mention is I'm actually building this out without like fully planting them yet. I've got a layer of soil in the bottom. And now I'm just sticking in all of the root balls and then I will be adding more soil as needed. This is kind of the design of the rim of the crust I have so far. Some sweet potato vines, begonia in white and red, and then these coleus right here. And then I think I'm also going to shove in a couple of these red splash selects. I think that is super pretty. Looks like pizza sauce splattered on top of basil or something. I think I'll squeeze in a couple of those and then keep going. These are so pretty. And we ended up using all of those plants, you guys. This is the finished product and I'm absolutely loving how it's looking. So all the way around the edge, you can see the crusty, the brown foliage. That's what we're calling the crust. And then inside there's a mix of reds, yellows, greens, whites. A little bit of white right here. White. There's a pink. So yeah, everything is just supposed to be a different pizza topping. So we've got basil. Like I said, we've got the crust. Here's some Parmesan cheese. Mozzarella. Little multicolored tomatoes little hot peppers this could probably be a pepper too then we got some cheddar cheese some pepperoni capicola mozzarella but shredded so yeah we've got some moss roses over here we've got absolutely tons of plants these are just some of them the sun mass hosta Dwarf red salvia, orange portulaca, dwarf bush basil, petunia, tritunia mix, red with blotch pansy, what's this one say? White dianthus, white splash select ipiostes, orange plume celosia, um, calabrocoa in red, and, and there's also a lot more plants in here, but overall, I just absolutely love how it turns out. Xena over here definitely helped plant it up. If you liked this video, make sure to give us a big thumbs up, comment down below, and subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to hit that bell if you never want to miss the next time Xena plants up a new pot. Get out and enjoy what God has given us. Dear God, please um, keep your watch over everyone. We pray that everyone is on your plan and your timing is not our timing, but we just pray that you keep your hands on everyone and keep leading everyone in the direction that you want them to go. Amen. So hopefully our family member loves this and it can bring a little bit of joy to their day. And if you've got somebody in the hospital or having a bad time, maybe you should try to plant them a crazy looking pot. Normally this is much more wild than I would make, but I really, really like it. 
I think I got the pizza kind of situation across. But yeah, get out and enjoy what God has given us and get out and enjoy nature and food as much as we do. Have a great one.